Oh, you caught me resting, didn't you? It's your favorite announcer, Mark Moreland, the emo here, with a little report on our action last night. I hope you're enjoying your Memorial Day weekend as I'm up here in my undisclosed location, enjoying the weekend with some people I love. Hope you're doing the same. Up out of the basement, as I say, and out into the outdoors, and I'll give you a little report on what happened last night. It was so exciting, exciting racing at El Paso County Raceway last night, just in Callahan, just a little bit southeast of us here, southeast of us. We had a great, great race, and and to start out the night, we had our late model main event, the dirt car late models, and that was won by our promoter, Racing Joe Bellum. Racing Joe Bellum put it out front, got that Summit Automotive Group, Black Will, late model, and Victory Lane. And then the next race, we had our IMCA stock cars, which was always exciting. The winner of that was Mr. Lessig Sr., Brian Lessig Sr. won that race. Second place was uh, Mr. Reed, Phil Reed won second, and then third place was exciting. There's a battle on the last lap between Phil Lessig Jr. and and Ladybug Bellum, and by 22 hundredths of a second, Mr. Young Lessig Jr. took third. Well, then we got to our sport mods, and that's where the excitement really was. It was a battle through the whole race. The young 44 of Mr. Ogden, Frankie Ogden, pulled out front and was leading the race, and then here comes Travis Palmer. Travis Palmer comes from fourth place. No, he's going to third place, and he hokey-doked him, and he weaseled up into second place. Pretty soon, he got around Ogden, and he's leading the race. He comes out of four, and, and this is around lap 11, 20 lap race, and it looked like he might have tapped the wall with his right rear and he wound up going up into the wall in the one and two and, and I go over the, to the pits later on to see what's going on with these guys and Travis he broke the uh, right rear on his car he broke the the just the, the whole frame comes off where the where the rear end mounts so that put him out of the race and then then we had a new leader so Frankie Ogden takes over the lead again and Frankie Ogden's leading and pretty soon Frankie Ogden slows and Dave Stock catches him he just came to a stop and then that got Dave sideways but Frankie Frankie Ogden blew a motor. So then Frankie Ogden's out of the race. So here we go. We get another restart. Then they're battling it out. And it's Chris O'Connor and it's Jimmy Jarno now. And they're battling out the last few laps. They were side by side. They were rubbing. They're throwing elbows. It was it was awesome, man. And then Greenbeard, Chris O'Connor wins his first feature. What a great night it was with the sport mods. Great, great race. And then we go on to our sport compacts. Brian Moore won that feature. Then our dwarf cars, Brett Peel. Brett Peel won the dwarf dwarf car feature and then we had what is uh, new to El Paso County the junior compacts and what that is is an IMCA compact sport compact with 7 to 13 year olds and I'm telling you they were exciting and the young man that won that was Martin Adams and, and I come to find out the son of Clint Adams a long time racer and a champion in his own right Clint Adams so the young man Martin Adams won that race then the hobby stocks that was exciting Brad Willox gets out front he's leading the race here comes young Worthington Jacob Worthington in there, back and forth, back and forth, throwing elbows. Jacob's on the inside, trying to get him. But Brad Willox won, winds up winning that race. Jacob comes in second. Then we have our Warriors, our Warrior cars. Craig Smith comes down with that number 50 car. That thing's always fast, and he just dominated that race. J.D. Renfro finishes second, and Joe Renfro comes all the way from eighth up into fourth place, so Joe gives her a good ride last night. That gang green, they're always good. Like to see him come back from Cheyenne. So that's what happened at El Paso County last night. Exciting racing for everyone. Hopefully you were there. Hopefully if you were, you saw it on the IMCA TV. You can always stream our races on BST Productions. That's what I got for you today. I'll be seeing you later in the week. Let you know what's going on next weekend. So until next time, hope to see you in the Victory Circle. <music>